Hey everyone, we're here on Cyrene, and today I thought we would go ahead and chain out a bunch of these weak panel ends. And I thought I would quickly go over why you might want to hunt these while you're on Cyrene. There's going to be a few reasons. The first is there's a chance you get a tail tip. Tail tips are a 5 pack item that goes for about 1 ped each, give or take, depending on how quickly you want to get rid of it. The first armor pristine drops off panel ends. So there's a small chance you get uh, a rare pristine element. They're still really valuable. We're actually going to do it because there's not too many mobs on Cyrene that drop the muscle oil. And we're trying to do the muscle B compound for that first aid pack upgrade. And so let's, I'm gonna, I don't want to have to loot everything. So we're going to take one of those. And we'll take a skill pill just because. And let's get started. Oh, that, that's going to be some serious overkill, huh? Well, we're definitely getting some muscle oil, it looks like. I'm kind of worried that I'm going to accidentally shoot um, that guy's mob over there. So I'm going to have to manually click everything, I think. And so we're trying to get up to 2,000 muscle oil is actually what we need to do that run. The tail tips are also kind of rare. Um, I've gone multi-hundred kills without seeing any drop. Yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of the setup I got going on right now. Let's check out this plateau real fast. Maybe we can get away from everyone. And some of these swanters might be pulling off the plateau. And they should still be able to do that, I think. But definitely less chance that I just grab someone's mob this way, I think. And so basically, we need tail tips. It'd be cool to get a pristine element. And we need muscle oil. There's a tail tip. Oh, nice. We're getting some animal hide as well. That's good for some uh, the generic leather texture. Oh, there's another tail tip. They're being nice to us today. So the panelians have a pretty reasonable drop list. It's pretty big. 
you'll get a variety of things here. Um, a lot of muscle oil, a lot of this oil residue, tier one components. They drop a extractor. Let's see which one is it, this one? The basic leather extractor I've gotten from them. Obviously a bunch of shrapnel. Looks like we just got a socket one component. Add that to the list. Advanced stone extractors. Well, we're making some progress on the... Uh, amount of muscle oil we need. Not super great progress, but some progress. We're only getting like around three per loot or so when we get it. So that's going to take a little while. But the first uh, officer plate takes 50 tail tips each for each plate. So to get seven of them done, it's 350 tail tips. We'll let him pull one. I'm assuming he's got one targeted. Maybe not. So again, these guys have a pretty reasonably big loot list. Outside of those, those don't drop off them. And so I'm not sure what the best maturity to go for is if you're shooting for that pristine. I think it's a one pad pristine. And so I'm not sure that these are your best choice. Maybe something with a little more hit points where you're more likely to draw a one pad loot out. And it's not the entirety of the loot you're getting. So 
So it looks like we got a second before we're going to be even close to that. We're only at 1,100 of 2,000. Oh, the other thing there's a chance that we'll draw while killing these guys out here is the actual arc armor that you need to do the initial upgrade to get the Imperium armor. That uh, Imperium armor is the one that looks like that bison from uh, Street Fighter. At least that's what it reminds me of. Maybe we should have just done the uh, weak panel in cave. We'd have to run around a little more, but we wouldn't have to worry about hitting someone else's mob on accident. I am excited about the animal hide though. That'll help us do a texture run. Uh, potentially, depending on how much we get. But I think we were pretty close and didn't need more than a couple hundred more um, of the generic leather to do that texture. So hopefully this will put us real close. Well, it looks like we got those two tail tips right out the gate, and then it went back to the normal stingy mode that we're more used to seeing. I think we need the tail tips for the armor again, but we have the plates kind of wrapped up already um, for that first tier. Oh, that was a nice one. That was a big chunk of muscle oil. That'll help us out a lot. Ooh, see, I almost targeted that guy's one.
Luckily, I caught it before we were close enough to shoot. We're going to move this way, I think, a little bit. I don't see that uh, green dot over here anymore. And so I think we can post up and not have to worry about accidentally shooting anyone anymore. Or their mob, rather. Yeah, this is much nicer. But we still have 500 muscle oil to collect, so we still got a small little chunk to go. But it's definitely going a little faster than I thought. But it still looks like we're at those, just those two tail tips we started with, kind of right out the gate. And then a whole bunch of uh, the oil we, we were kind of after. Nothing really notable outside of that. We'll get a bunch of shrapnel. There was a little bit of paint. Paint always has a, at least a small markup. I always just hang on to it. We'll, we'll use it to paint something one day. We'll see how just standing in the center goes. While we crank out these next 400 muscle oils so we can do that one crafting run. And we'll see how that goes. We're not great at the uh, manufacturer electronics, which is what I think that uh, the category that's going to fall into.
we're starting to get kind of close. Oh, that that definitely helped us along the way. That was a nice little uh, weak penalty in. 4.7-ish ped. Let's go make sure our loot can get those last guys. I was hoping using the bigger gun and the laser sight scope, like a full kit, would help with our uh, amount of tail tips, but it actually didn't seem to at all. Um, I think they're just super rare. And so I'm not sure out of just kill more, what, what advice to say when you're trying to get some. Alright, a hotter to go. Oh, that was a really nice one. Nine and a half ped. All shrapnel, but still a nice little hit. No, the codex goes real slow on these because the stalkers have like 2,000 hit points and these weak ones only have like 80 and so there's a big discrepancy over the maturity, like the gap between the maturities. Well, we were doing really good, and then there was a little bit of a dry spell on the muscle oil.
All right, ten more to go. Nine more. All right, we only need seven more. We'll switch to our slightly more eco weapon since it's not limited and we don't have to pay a markup on it. Our DPS is going to be massively lower though for this final little. I just want to make sure that we would get enough. And with seven to go, if we have to switch back for a second at the end to cap it off or whatnot, uh, not the end of the world. I don't think that's going to be an issue. No, I'm really glad they put these weak Panelians in. Before it was just the young ones. And these are an excellent addition for um, the younger player. And obviously I like them um, as a... I, I guess I consider myself a mid-range player. Where I've been around for a few years. Um, but they're still excellent to skill on. They have a good grouping of drops. And they're used in the first stage of the armor and the armor plates. But I think we're going to wrap up here with this one. Um, we did get the 2,000 uh, muscle oil we needed. So we'll be doing that crafting uh, right around the corner. I hope everyone's having an amazing day. Stay epic.